Well, breast augmentation is naturally common in, in younger uh, ladies who have gone through puberty and the breast haven't developed fully. Um, and they want to have an enhancement uh, once the breast development is complete. Now, during maturity and puberty, um, the frame of the chest wall uh, and the skin and the breast development occurs. Now, this can vary in individual people. And the most important thing is uh, to ask the patient at what point have they felt that their breast shape has not changed over the last year. And if it's been static for a year or so, usually around the age of 18, 19, then the breast development is complete. However, when considering a patient for breast augmentation, it's important to also assess not only that they have physical maturity, because this will uh, change if the procedure is done prior to that, then they may have a desired effect, but as the breast continue to develop further, then the, the shape and the, the um, size of the breast may differ. And so it's important to make sure that the development is complete. But also it's important that they have developed mental maturity, they understand the consequences of surgery, and that with breast implant surgery, that this is something that will in future require further surgery as a result of either scar formation around the breast implants or as a result of breast changing uh, shape over the period of years to come as they uh, enlarge their breasts during pregnancy and breastfeeding as well as weight loss or uh, at times where uh, they go through menopause and they will require further breast surgery, either an uplift or change of implants to a different one. And understanding the risks of surgery is really important, which sometimes uh, may be difficult to comprehend for somebody who has not fully matured mentally.